It's now time for private properties. The Palm Springs, California mansion where Elvis Presley honeymooned with Priscilla in May 1967 is going on the market for nine and a half million dollars. Joining me now with the tour of that and this week's other private properties is Candace Taylor. Candace, thank you very much for being here. It's uh, always always a pleasure when Thanks. you're here. So t <laughs> tell us about Elvis's hideaway honeymoon place. Yes, so Elvis rented this in 1966 as kind of just a getaway from Hollywood. And then when he and Priscilla got married, this is where they came to have their honeymoon. Um, and the current owner has is kind of an Elvis junkie. Uh, there are many of, of them out there, and so he's restored the home to be pretty much exactly the way it was back in the 60s. So now if you go there, you can get a tour from, from someone in an Elvis or Priscilla costume. Wow. And uh, they, there's all kinds of uh, pictures of them in the house and other Elvis memorabilia in the house. And, of course, we, all, we always love the Elvis in Work for the Elvis in person is, is great, of course. Um, musician, we'll stick with the musician thing. Musician Joe Cocker, this is Colorado Ranch for seven million bucks. Yes, absolutely. So uh, Joe's obviously famous for his performance at Woodstock and his music over the years. And uh, this is just a place where he relaxes in Colorado. Um you know, to, to kind of get away from it The shots of Colorado, I mean, we did, we've, we've done private, a lot of private properties. Whenever we have the shots of Colorado, it's always amazing. I mean, just the, the views are breathtaking. The scenery is fantastic. And this is 240 acres that he has here. Um, and as you can see, he's, he's English, so he's brought a lot of sort of European elements uh, to this ranch, which is which is kind of unusual in sort of a, a Western setting like See, that. See, I'd, I'd fit in just absolutely dandled that. <laughs> I guess oh, so. Okay, so there's a large unfinished Florida penthouse going into contract. Now tell us about that. So this is the 47th floor of this building. It's called the Mansions at Aquilina. And uh, this unit had been part of what they call the Palazzo de Oro, which had been on the market for over a year at 55 million. Wow. So someone came in and bought just the top half of it. it, has a massive pool on the terrace. That's the main attraction. But if you're disappointed to hear that it's off the market, don't worry. They have another one on the market for $50 million. Wow. And uh, a, fun, a fun element that this building has is all the residents have access to a Rolls-Royce Phantom, which uh, you can reserve at the front desk to have a chauffeur drive you around in it. Great stuff. Thank you very much. Candace Taylor of the Wall Street Journal.